But the average American these days eats 152 pounds mm. of refined sugar per year. 100, 200 years ago, we were probably eating around one pound of refined sugar per year. That's 152 times the amount of substrate that these poor little cells have to process. They break down. They just say no. And, and what that looks like is insulin resistance. When we eat carbohydrates and sugar, the body releases insulin, a hormone, to help you take that sugar um, out of the bloodstream into the cells so that it can be used for these metabolic processes. The main issue is, is that our lifestyle and what we're eating and what we're doing and how we're living is hijacking that process, that food to energy process. One of the big, big key players is the amount of sugar that we're eating in our diet. It really comes down to choices. And right now, we don't have a lot of help to understand what choices to make for our own body. And that's where wearables and especially bio wearables, I think can be very, very helpful.